children welcome to aims india's online classes so in today's class we will be discussing state and national level pre previous olympiad questions from the topic number sense okay. starting with the first question the successor of a number is one more than the number and the predecessor is one less than the number which one of the following digits does not occur in the difference between the successor of successor of how much children let us put commas and read yes yes 6 crore 78 lakhs 54,398 and the predecessor of 5 crores 46 lakhs 77,456 now see here they have already given what is a successor and a predecessor now how to find the successor of this one we should subtract 1 yes so here 8 minus sorry successor right successor means we need to add 1 now 8 plus 1 becomes what children 8 plus 1 becomes 9 so instead of 8 here we will have 9 this will be a successor and coming to the predecessor what is predecessor predecessor is 1 less than the number so when we subtract 6 minus 1 becomes 5 yes so the successor in the, in the predecessor will have 5 now what to do we should find out the difference 6 crore 78 lakh 53,399 minus 5 crores 46 lakhs 77,455 yes children now 5 minus 9 minus 5 4 again 9 minus 5 4 3 minus 4 is not possible we will borrow 13 minus 4 9 again 3 minus 7 is not possible uh, 13 minus 7 is 6 yes 4 minus 7 again not possible yes 7 1 3 and 1 what is the answer 1 crore 31 lakh 76,944. Now what are they saying? Which of the following digits does not occur in the difference? Now see, first option is 5. Do we have 5 in the difference? No. So A will be our right answer. See 9. We are having 9 here and 1. We are having 1 and 7 also we are having. Option, five, option A, 5 becomes the correct answer because we are not having it in the difference. Okay children? Next question. The set of the numbers are arranged in order greatest to least is called descending order. Which one of the following set of numbers is in descending order? If the numbers are formed using only 5, 7, 6, 3, 8, 6, 2, 4. Now what are they saying? Again they have given us what is the meaning of descending order. What do we do? We will arrange the numbers from the greatest to least. Yes? from the greatest to least now what are they saying of the given options which numbers are in the descending order that to the numbers are to be formed only using these digits 5 7 6 3 8 uh, 8 6 2 4 okay children now what should we do first let us form the now of these numbers which is the largest digit 8 yes or no so the first number will have 8 in the first place that is in their highest place value now if you look at the given options option c is having option c is having 8 here yes option c is having 8 in the highest place yes all the numbers are having 8 now let us see if the order is in descending order or not that is from big to the greatest to the least let me put commas yes so this is 86 lakhs 87324 if you look at this children the first two, digit, two digits are the same in all the numbers so we'll go with the third digit now here we are having 8 and 7 again here also the next two digits are also the same yes see how do we compare we'll compare digit by digit yes or no here the first four digits are same so we are going with comparing the third fifth digit three and two which is the bigger number three is the bigger number then comes two so yes these are in the descending order when it comes to the third number now here we are having 86 87 here we are having 86 77 see eight is in the third place here seven is in the third place again 8 is the bigger number 7 is the smaller number so these are also in descending order now coming to the last two numbers 
what is this 86 lakh 77,000 and this is 86 lakh 76,000 look at the fourth digit children now this is the bigger number and this is the smaller number so again these are in descending order so what did we conclude all the numbers all these four numbers are in descending order now let us check whether these are formed using the given digits only do we have eight yes then do we have six yes again do we have seven yes three two four are also there now next eight six eight seven all are there two eight four two eight four are, are also there next eight six seven seven three two four again all the numbers are there yes children yes so next again eight six seven six five two four 8676524 all the numbers are there so this this is the option c is our correct answer where all the digits are formed using the all the numbers are formed using the given digits and also they are placed in descending order that is from the largest to the smallest okay children moving on to the next question yes the set sorry 3 into what is this again let us put commas 3 into 1 crore plus 4 into 1 lakh plus 7 into 1000 plus 9 into 10 plus 7 what is this this is our expanded form we need to write the short form of it yes now what is the highest place value here crores so i will write the place value still crores 1 tens hundreds thousands ten thousands lakhs 10 lakhs and crores okay children 3 is in crores place now what is this this is 1 lakh so 4 is in lakhs place now 1000 7 is in thousands place now 9 into 10 so 9 in tens place and 7 in the ones place now this is our number what about the remaining places what to write we should write zeros yes so there are 0 10 lakhs 0 10 thousands and 0 hundreds now what is our what do you say what is our ex a short form 3 crores 4 lakhs 7097 that is the same as what that is the same as option b yes 3040797 so option b is our correct answer okay moving on what is the difference between the place value of 8 and face value of 9 in the number now from this number what should we find out the difference of place value of 8 and face value of 9 now what is the face value children the face value of a digit is the same as the digit itself yes so we are having 9 here so the face value will also be equal to 9 now coming to the place value it depends on the place ones tens hundreds thousands ten thousands lakhs ten lakhs and crores 8 is in which place 8 is in crores place so its place value becomes 8 crores now how to write 8 crores see after 8 how many digits are we having 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 we are having 7 digits yes so place 7 zeros 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 now this becomes our place value of 8 from this we should subtract 9 yes children when we have to subtract like this so many zeros what should we do is first zero becomes 10 all the other zeros become 9 yes and after this zeros will having will be having one digit right non zero digit so that will become minus 1 8 minus 1 becomes 7 okay now let us subtract 10 minus 9 1 and then the remaining digits are to be written as it is yes 9 9 9 9 and 7 what is our answer 7 crores 99 lakhs 991 that is the same as option c is 7 crores 99 lakhs 99,991 is our correct answer next question find the missing number 10 15 18 23 26 31 34 dash and 42 yes children whenever such filling the missing number in the pattern is given what should you do first check the difference now what is the difference here 5 i mean 10 plus 5 will give us 15 yes now how to get 18 15 plus 3 is equal to 18 now again 18 plus 5 is equal to 23 and 23 plus 3 is equal to 26 
Now what are we observing here? Yes, one number is yes the first number is added by 5 and the next number is added by increased by 3. Yes, alternatively one is to be increased by 5 and the other is to be increased by 3. Now if you look at the numbers here, now after 26 when we add 5 we got 31. Then when we added 3 we will get 34. Now what should we add next to 34? 5. Yes or no? We are adding 5 and 3 in alternative. Uh, in uh, Sorry, we are adding 5 and 3 alternatively. Just now we added 3 to 31 to get 34. So for this 34 we will add 5. It becomes 35, 39. So option B 39 is our correct answer. Again, to this 39 when we add 3 we will get 42 as our answer. That is the number given here. Yes? So adding 5 then adding 3. Adding 5, adding 3. Option B, 39 becomes a correct answer. Next question. 5, 4, star mark 0, 1 is a 5 digit number which is exactly divisible by 3. Find the digit that will come in place of star. Now what is the divisibility rule of 3? Now suppose if you have a number 123 and when I add all the digits like 1 plus 2 is equal to 3, 3 plus 3 is 6. Now this sum should be divisible by 3. 6 is 6 divisible by 3? Yes, 3 twos are 6. It is exactly divisible. So when the sum is exactly divisible, the number 123 is also divisible by 3. Okay children, now let us, now let us see which of the numbers, so when we place which number does the sum become exactly divisible by 3. Let us take the options. First option is 0. So when we add 5 plus 4 is okay before adding 0 what I'll do is I'll add the given numbers 5 plus 4 9 9 plus 0 0 0 plus 1 becomes 10 so what do we have 10 yes without the missing digit we have 10 now let us add the given options 0 so when we add 10 to 0 what does it become 0 on, 10 only now is 10 divisible by 3 no we will not get 10 in the 3 table. So moving on to the next number that is 1. So when we add 1 to 10 it becomes 11. Now again does 11 come in 3 table? No. So moving on to the next number that is 2. 10 plus 2 becomes 12. Does 12 come in 3 table? Yes. We know that 3 4s are 12. So when we place 2 in the when we place 2 in, when we place 2 in place of this star then the resulting number that is 54,201 will be exactly divisible by 3. Clear children? Next, write the following number in words as per international system of numerations. Now this is very easy for us, yes? So international system means commas after every 3 digits. Yes, now let us write the period. This is the ones period. Then we have the thousands. Then we have the millions and then we have the billions period. Yes children. So how will we read it? 35 billion. Now look at the options. 35 billion, 35 billion, 35 billion, 35 billion. All are the same. Moving to 734 million. 735. It is saying 35 but we are having 34. So this is wrong. 734 million. Yes. 734 million, 734 million. Next we have 385,000. No option A is already wrong so no need to check. 385, 384, it is saying 84. So this is our wrong option. Let me cut it out. Let us see 385,000. Yes. Next 375,000. Again it is saying 75 but what we have? We have 85,000. So option D is also a wrong answer. Now lastly we have 109. So option C is the correct answer. 35 billion 734 million 385,109 is the number name for the given number as per international system of numeration. Okay children. Next question. Which of the following number should be inserted in the blank box in the following pyramid? Now if you observe carefully what happens in pyramid means now below 200 we are having 120 and 80. So when we add these two numbers together 
what will get will get the upper number that is 200 okay children now you can see here also 10 plus 20 30 30 plus 40 70 now here we are having a missing number in the middle yes now how to find it out again so when we add the below two numbers we will get the above number what is it 20 plus 30 is equal to 0 and 5 50 so 50 is our correct answer that is option D okay children very simple right when we add the below two numbers we will get our above number that is 50 here next question 99999 is the greatest dash digit number which digit number 1 2 3 4 5 it has 5 digits so it is the greatest 5 digit number yes next place value of 5 in 5 lakh 43,654 is dash. Now see 5 is in 2 places. First it is in lakhs place and then it is in tens place. So what is its place value? It is both lakhs and tens. The place value of 5 is both lakhs and tens. Okay. Next the smallest 6 digit number is equal to. Now how to write the smallest 6 digit number? First make 6 places. Yes. Now the first number should be 1 and the remaining digits would be filled with zeros. So what is this? 1 followed by 5 zeros that is 1 lakh. Option B will be our correct answer. Okay children. Next question. Let me put commas. 3 lakhs plus 20,000 plus 4,000 plus 200 plus 20 plus 2 is equal to dash. Now again this is what this is again a expanded form for which we have to write the short form now here lakhs is the highest place 3 is in lakhs place 2 in 10 thousands place 4 in thousands 2 in hundreds again 2 in tens place and 2 in ones place what is our answer 3 2 4 2 2 2 that is the same as option a 3 lakh 24222 okay children next ones period includes what do we have in the ones period ones tens and hundreds yes so in the given options option a hundred is our correct answer next lakhs period include includes lakhs period includes what lakhs and ten lakhs so option b lakh becomes our correct answer thousands period includes now what do we have in thousands period thousands and ten thousands now which is the correct answer option a 10,000 yes next pick the odd one out hundreds tens ones and thousands now of these which is the odd one option d thousands is the odd one why why because ones tens and hundreds belong to the ones period yes they are belonging to the same period but whereas thousands belongs to the thousands period so option d thousands becomes our odd one here Next question. We use dash to separate the periods. What do we use children? Separate the periods. Yes, after once period we will place a comma. And after thousands again we will place a comma. Yes. So what are we using? We are using option A. Comma to separate the periods. Next. 4,37,283 is a dash number. Option A. 4 digit number. Option B. 5 digit option c six digit and option d seven digit now how to find out very simple right count the number of digits one two three four five six so option c six digit is our correct answer next instead of putting comma we can dash to separate the periods so what are they saying normally what do we do children See, we use commas to separate the periods. Yes? So, what are they saying? Instead of this comma, what can we do? What can we use to separate the periods? Means, option B, leave space and option C, put full stop. I can write it like this also. Okay. 7 space 15 comma 834. Now, what does this mean? This means that 7,15,834 only. We do not use this but in international internationally uh, some countries use this comma or also use full stop say 10 yes 
what will be this be 10 crores sorry 10 millions 515 see they are placing a full stop instead of a comma so internationally space or full stop is also used to separate the periods okay children next tick the odd one out now here we are having four options now how to solve this observe the numbers carefully yes if you see here in all the numbers the in the first three numbers the commas are placed correctly first one after three digits and then two digits but if you look at option d here commas are placed after every two digits is this correct way of putting commas no so this will be our odd one out okay children then way we have put the commas is not correct so this will be our odd one out next question again pick the odd one out now 6,44,245, 4,65,345, option C, 2,55,666 and option D, yes, look at the commas here, the commas are not placed correctly, first the comma should be placed after 3 digits, yes, so here and then after 2 digits, here, so this should have been the correct way of placing commas. So, option D becomes our odd one here. Next, again, pick the odd one out. Again, see here, commas are correct. Here also the commas are correct. Even here the commas are correct. Only here, after two, the commas are placed after every two digits. So, D becomes our odd one. Next, 3,44,567 has dash lakhs. Now, if you write the place values, once tens, hundreds, thousands, ten thousands and lakhs, we can directly say that this number has how many lakhs children? It has three lakhs. Yes. So, that will be our correct answer. Straightforward question. Option A, three lakhs is our correct answer. Next. Three lakh forty-four thousand five hundred and sixty-seven has dash thousands. Now, if you look at the place values again, once tens, hundreds, thousands and ten thousands and lakhs so what is there in the thousands place four so when you look at the options three four five and six option b four becomes our correct answer next again three lakh forty four thousand five hundred and sixty seven has dash ones if you look at the ones place we have seven so option c seven becomes our correct answer next again the same number has dash tens if you look at the tens place, we are having 6. So, option D, 6 becomes our correct answer. Clear, children? Now, dash hundreds, 3,44,567 has dash hundreds. 5 is in the hundreds place. So, the correct answer becomes option C, 5. So, next question, match the following. Now, what do we have in the list 1? We are having the numbers and in the sorry children yes and in the list 2 we are having the number name so we have to match them with one another yes so firstly we have 5 lakhs 5 lakhs 45,667 now that is 4 here so a is equal to 4 now option uh, list sorry the number b in list 1 is 1 lakh so b is 1 yes a is 4 b is 1 now option c here is 4,45,953 that is 2, C is equal to 2 and lastly what is left here 3. So even without solving we can say that 3 is the correct answer. Yes, 6 lakhs, 6,34,672. 6, lakh now what is the correct one? 4, 1, 2, 3. If you look at the options, 4, 1, 2, 3. So option A is our correct answer. Yes, A, B, sorry. Sorry children, option is not a correct answer. See, they are saying A is 4, B is 1. Yes, correct. Again, they are saying B is 2, C is 3. No, this is wrong. So, option B is a wrong answer. Coming to, option A is wrong. Coming to B, A is 4. Yes, B is 1. Yes, C is 2. Yes, D is 3. So, option B becomes our correct answer. Okay. Next question. 6,46,545 is equal to dash. Now, we have to write what? We have to write the expanded form of the given number. 
yes now let us see 1 2 3 4 5 6 we need to have we are having six digits so we need to have six numbers there 1 2 3 4 5 this is only 5 so wrong 1 2 3 4 5 6 so this can be the number again yes all these are having five uh, sorry six digits so this this can be our options now firstly six lakhs one two three four five after six we need to have five zeros yes so yes this is six lakhs this is also six lakhs and this is also six lakhs next to forty thousand yes these two are having forty thousand but here it is four thousand so option d is wrong here next we have six thousand 6000 6000 years then we have 5 in the hundreds place 500 but here it is 50 so option c is also our wrong answer only option b is our right answer 6 lakhs plus 40000 plus 6000 plus 500 plus 50 plus 5 is the expanded form of 6 lakh 45 next question write 1 lakh in figures now how to write 1 lakh in figures children first write the place values till 1 lakh okay write 1 in the lakhs place and then now fill up the sorry what am I doing here this is 10,000 so 1 yes so now fill up the remaining places with zeros so what do we have 1 followed by 5 zeros that is option A 1 0 0 0 0 0 is a num numeral for 1 lakhs next draw a place value chart for 2 lakh 222 now what is the place value chart here let us see if you look at the options the answer is in terms of period so this is the ones period this is the thousands period and this is the lakhs period yes now let us check in lakhs period we have 2 yes lakhs period 2 2 2 so all are correct here in thousands period we have 0 0 in thousands period we do not have 22 nor 2 we only have 0 0 and in ones period we have 222 so option a becomes our correct answer yes here the thousands period is given wrong in all the three options only option a is the correct one next question write the expanded notation of 5 lakhs now how to write the expanded notation of 5 lakhs children this is our number 5 lakhs yes so how to write the expanded form means first we are writing the 5 in the lakhs place so after 5 there are 5 digits so placing 5 zeros plus next we have 0 after 0 we are having 4 digits so placing 4 zeros plus again we have 0 then 3 zero, three zeros plus 3 zeros plus 2 zeros plus 1 zero yes yes so f after 5 5 zeros then after 0 4 zeros after 0 3 zeros after 0 2 zeros and after 0 1 zero and 0 this will be our expanded form yes that is how we write the expanded form yes so option C and option D are completely wrong or we can simply write 5 lakh as the expanded form but here look at this this is not 5 lakh this is 50,000 and this is 5,000 now how many pluses should we have 1 1 2 3 4 and 5 yes 1 2 3 4 there are only 4 plus symbols so this is wrong 1 2 3 4 5 yes option C is having all the 5 plus symbols and if you look at the number of zeros also it is it is the same as the our expanded form so option a becomes our correct answer okay children next put the commas put the missing commas how to give the commas we know right first after three digits and then after two digits two digits so this will be our number with the correct commas that is option a 6,45,333 or it can be option d as well yes both option a and option d can be a correct answer now this is in the international form right yes they did not mention specifically that the comma should be placed according to the indian system or the international system 
So both option A and D are the correct answers. Next question. In the following number series, find the missing number. 5, 14, 32, 68, 140 and 220. Wait a second children. Let me check whether. Yes. Yes. So what I am thinking is the correct one here. Now if you look at the numbers, the numbers are increasing drastically. Increasing by a large number. See here 5 plus 9 gives us 14. But here what does it give? It 14 plus 18 gives us 32. Yes. Now 32 plus what? 32 plus uh, 36. Yes. 32 plus 36 gives us 68. And then see, when we take the difference of 140 and 68. 2. Again we need to borrow. 7. So 72 becomes the number. We need to add 72 here. So what are we understanding? Now look at the numbers 9, 18, 36 and 72. And lastly what do we have? See 284 minus 140. 4, 4, 1. 144. See 144. If you look at the numbers that we are adding to each number. They are increasing by very by a big Sorry, there is a big difference between the number. Yes. So, what is the connection between this number? If you think children, 9 2s are 18. Yes or no? 9 2s are 18. Then again, 18 2s are becomes 8 2s are 16. 1 carried. 8 2, 2 1s are 2 plus 1, 3. That is what we got here. 36. Now again, 36 2s are becomes what? 6 2s are 12. 1 carried, 3 2s are 6 plus 1, 72. Yes, that is what we got. Again, 72 into 2 becomes 2 2s are 4, 7 2s are 14, 144. That means the number that we are adding is doubling. That we have to multiply it by 2 for each number. First, we took we added 9. Then we need to add 9 2s are 18. And then 18 plus 2, 18 into 2, 36. And then again, the double of 36, 72. And then the double of 72, 144. Now what should we add to get the next number? The double of 144. So 144 into 2. 2 4s are 8. 2 4s are 8. 2 1s are 2. So 288. We need to add 288 to this number. 284 plus 288. 4 plus 8, 12. 8 plus 8, 16 plus 1, 17. And 2 plus 1, 3. 3 plus 2, 5. 572 is our answer. That is option B. Okay, children. I hope this is clear. Yes. Yes. Next. Write 4,23,456 in words. That is, I have read it out aloud only. So, that will be our uh, number name for it. Yes. 4 lakhs. Do we have 4 lakhs? But this is in... What do you say? Numbers are again used here. So, we will cross this off. 4 lakh, 4 lakh, 4 lakh. Yes. Next, 23,000. 23,000, 23,000. But here we are having 20,000. So, wrong option. 400, 400, 400. 56. Here there is no 56 only. So, option B is wrong. Only option C is our correct answer. 4 lakh, 23,456. Yes, children. I hope this was clear. Yes. Today what did we discuss? We discussed previous Olympiad questions. Now with this we have come to the end of today's class. I hope today's class was clear. And even tomorrow we will continue. What? We will continue some of the. Some more problems. Some more previous Olympiad questions. Yes. I hope today's class was clear. Thank you for watching our video. Please subscribe our channel. And press the bell icon.